Coast Guard officials suspended their search today for possible survivors of a tragic boat fire off the coast of Ventura. 34 people are presumed dead after the 75 foot long charter dive boat burst into flames. Tonight we learned a San Diegan who worked at a Coronado restaurant is one of the victims along with four family members. News 8's Amanda Shotsky is live in Coronado with how she's being remembered. Amanda. Nicole Kitasol worked here at Nikki Rotten's in Coronado for four years. She even had regular customers who came here just to see her. Now tonight, staff is hoping to share her story. They say it is one of a young woman who loved the ocean and her family. They were together when tragedy struck. We're missing a huge chunk of our team. Nikki Rotten's in Coronado is mourning the loss of its bartender and server of the last four years, Nicole Kita Soul. Loved the outdoors, loved the ocean, loved her dog, you know, and loved her family here. She has been identified as one of 34 people killed during a horrific boat fire off the coast of Santa Cruz Islands early Monday morning. Passengers on board were presumably sleeping below deck when the fire erupted, sinking the charter boat. I can't breathe. Kita Sol was on the scuba diving excursion with her two sisters, father and stepmom, a family trip to celebrate her dad's birthday. Her stepbrother, Dominique Selda, says he's still trying to make sense of the tragedy and the fact that five members of his family are gone. Evan, she's the oldest, um, like I said, and she loved to dive with her dad too. Nicole, she was amazing, you know, good-hearted. Angela, she was a teacher. Amazing person too, affected so many kids' lives. Why did it happen? What did they wake up to? Were they awake? You know, did they even wake up? So many questions left unanswered. Kita Soul's co-workers trying to be a support for the family. CFO Bryn Butoff started a GoFundMe page to help with funeral costs. Writing in part, she will be remembered as an adventurous and loving soul. Our hearts are broken and we can't imagine the pain her family feels. Meantime, regular customers at Nikki Rotten's have been coming by to honor the bartender they knew with an infectious spirit. Full of life, full of energy, and, uh, you know, she's going to be greatly missed. And at last check, that GoFundMe page has already generated about $4,800. If you would like to donate, we have placed a link on our website. That is the CWSanDiego.com. Back to you.